this is Eric with Savon Nursery. I'm standing under this desert willow tree, which happens to be one of the favorite food sources, larval food sources for the Hubbard silk moth. And we know that those are under here. A lot of people ask this question, what are these that are underneath my trees? Ash trees, uh, desert willows, they get these little, these are droppings from that moth. Tomato hornworms also make the same kind of a dropping. Look they look like a I corn cob. Found. And look, this is the uh, neat. This is uh, one of the Hubbard moth uh, caterpillars. This is the larva of the Hubbard silk moth. And they eat desert willow trees. And they will put those droppings out, just like a tomato hornworm. They're related. So after they eat a bunch of leaves, they get really fat like that. Look at the chrome on that. They're really, really a fancy kind of a caterpillar with those horns that come out and the gold beading around the neck. They're pretty spectacular. Then they turn into a pupa. They dig down into the ground and turn into a pupa. You'll find these if you're digging around in your garden. You can put them back if you like the moth. They're a big moth that's brown with red underneath. And you see these in your garden, in the dirt, and that's the, the pupa. And then this will hatch into the moth. So nothing to worry about. Hubbard silk moth, they're really kind of a cool thing on your desert willow.